ever notice the price that they want on these cables? <clears throat> I've got some older ones that don't even work anymore because Windows has blocked them. It's really annoying. Um, but I was like very tempted to buy this package deal with this radio just to get another programming cable. I don't know where it went. And then I ran across some other interesting stuff. And see, nine dollars. Um, there's a, a a radio now that's out. It doesn't require a programming cable. You just program it with the USB C directly to the radio. And um, I thought, wow, that's pretty damn cool. So <clears throat> sometimes you can get a deal on a radio with a programming cable that's going to be like way better than buying it separately. So. Most times that's probably the best way to do it. We do have this new kind of Bluetooth programming thing, but I, I think unfortunately you have to give uh, permission to the Chinese government to access your phone in order to do that. Um, let's go page one. So, you know, like the average cables uh, could maybe work and not work. And also there's another problem is they don't fit into all the radios. Um, they sell these cables like this. One thing I did <clears throat> experience before was I had the um, TalkPod radio, which was a piece of crap. Um, but it has a um, a different shaped uh, plug, and it works on other radios, and it just plugs straight in. It, it comes in from that angle, um, like a, a T-shape, and there's no issue with it. So... <clears throat> These things are 25 bucks. I don't know if they're any good. But, and they sell stuff like this. And I, I, I've, the problem is with the drivers <clears throat> in the cable and whether or not Windows decides they want to block uh, the Chinese drivers because a lot of these cables are basically counterfeit. Um, you know, they haven't paid uh, Microsoft their ransom money for you know to license the cable so you know you basically at the mercy of what windows decides to do down the road like i literally have cables from 2014 15 and 16 and they don't work anymore because windows has broke uh, they they blocked the prolific chip and there's the other chip that they're using now um uh the uh 340 or something so I just don't know that I need another UV5R just to get a programming cable. Um, but I don't want to pay $6 for a cable either. And, I mean, like, and we don't even know if the cables are going to work. That's the other problem. So, um, I think the CH340 cable is pretty much, you know, good. Um... I've had cables that were marked differently that came up as a different type of cable. It's really hit or miss. Um, so it would be great to see them all move over to where the radio charges and programs from a single cable. That would be awesome. Um, so this one here is a UV 17 R plus comes with that. That one actually has air band. So here's a similar kind of deal, but this one claims to be 8 watts. Uh, comes with all the same crap for $33. Like $10 more. And then you have that one. So it's like, oh, I don't know. I don't know if it says which cable it comes with. If it's one of these stupid old f cables, then you might be screwed. Let's see. So it says it comes with a CH340. If it does, that's great. Look at this crap. $22 for a cable from B-Tech. What a frickin' ripoff. Let's go narrow this down here. So, it definitely is retarded when it comes to certain things. So some of these, if you just figure the cable costs seven to nine dollars, you're saving some money by buying the damn radio. So this is the new one here. 
USB-C programming and charging. Um, I have seen this radio for 29 somewhere. I just pulled it up because it was like the first one I saw. Um, let's see here. It's not opening. Oh, Lord. Come on. So, um, new technology type C programming. So, this is this is what we want. We want radios that we just plug in USB C, charge it with USB C. Um, so this radio has aviation band. I don't know anything about this radio. Um, I don't know how much it covers. I don't know how good it sounds. Um, it has dual PTT. Uh, two bands TX, eight bands RX. When they say eight bands, a lot of times they're basically counting like a bunch of the ham bands as two bands when they're only one band. So, um, the, these are all over though. There, there's a couple of them, but there's definitely one for $29 I saw earlier. Um, so your typical cables, they're yeah, like seven bucks. I mean, you know, it's just ridiculous. It's like, why does that cable cost seven dollars? Um, or why can't they just bundle it with every radio? So I don't, <clears throat> I don't really want to buy another radio with another cable that might not fit. Now, if I can find the the um, talk pod radio, I'll show you what I'm talking about about the connector. Um, it's really something else. It really works great because you can plug it straight in and you don't have to worry about the L shape hitting the side of the radio or not going in or not fully seating. Let me just go ahead and just search out the talk pod radio. Boy, this thing's slow today. Okay. I can't believe they want that much money for these stupid things. So one of these claims to be eight watts. One of them claims to be five watts. <clears throat> Doesn't come with a cable. Eight watts. Five watts, $29. So, okay, so this is the connector. I don't remember having the extra ring on it, but I used it on another radio when I had one of these. The problem with these radios is that the batteries on them are like really, really fitting poorly and they don't have anything on the bottom of the radio to keep it, if you set it on a table, it'll fall over. Um, it just was really cheap and also another notice the radio got real hot. Um, so maybe I had a dud. I don't know. Uh, spurious emissions, I think they're probably pretty bad. So um, they have the cheaper A36 SE. I don't know anything about that, but it, it's a little bit different. Um, there's also an NESECU branded one. Um, it would be cool to just get their programming cable. There's the NESECU version of it. And um, it's an A37, they call it. It's got the same little thing up at the top. I don't know if they're any better. I don't know if it comes with anything. It doesn't look like it.